says the Lord, the Alpha and the Omega. I am the beginning and I am the end and I'm everything in between. Therefore, I look upon the earth when men speak, when things that you see, things that you hear come out upon the movie screens are written in songs and declared throughout the earth what does this mean God says the Lord who knows all sees that which speaks before it's time I say to you because of your convoys that are arising in the earth did you think when they sang breaker one nine that this was to just speak a phrase no they were prophesying of this time breaking COVID-19 do you think when they would ask and they would say what is your 20 God says they were prophesying of that which they tried to bring upon you that will be the new breaker one nine when they said what is your 20 they tried to inflict you in the year of the beginning of your decade 2020 but I say to you as the spirit drove the enemy into the wilderness my spirit is driving that which will continue to arise and be known and identified as the people's movement but it shall not just be the people who are moving it is my spirit therefore watch as they begin to gather even greater by way of trucks and other vehicles that shall begin to form by the masses and watch what shall become a convoy of people by the millions and they will gather and they will go from city to city and they will sing they will wave banners and they will declare we shall not tolerate what is taking place and there is the sound that my spirit the spirit of truth is speaking louder therefore watch as my spirit speaks louder that which will form in the natural by way of masses of protesters but God says they will try to incriminate them and they will even look for ways to frame them but it will not stop what is being driven by my spirit do not believe the lies for even over Ukraine the media their mouth is filled listen to me the media their mouth is filled with war rhetoric and there are those who are pushing for war and there are those who would desire to even make it look like that Russia has done something to the Ukrainian people inside of their borders to bring them to war. Yet I am and I have been speaking to the leader of the bear. I've been speaking to you, Putin, and you are listening. Therefore, watch. Do not be caught up in the war rhetoric the media is creating and do not believe when they report certain things that would desire to frame a picture and bring Russia and Ukraine Ukraine to the place of battle for my voice is speaking louder and I am declaring truth and my truth shall expose the truth over Ukraine my truth shall expose even greater what they have resisted in that which is comes by 
the expression of freedom. And my voice of truth will continue to pull out of their holes and I will pull the sheets off and I will continue to show you what has been done in secret. You say, but Lord, what good is it if nothing happens? I said I am the Alpha. I am the Omega, the beginning, the end, and I'm everything in between. And I know exactly what I'm doing. And I declare game over. Lord, let your righteousness stand. Come on. Come on. There's something, there's something that's happening right now, and I can feel the voice of the Lord. And it's in the sound of the instruments. And it's making itself very clear to hell. This thing is up. <laughs> Come on. The intensity is going to increase. Come on. The intensity is going to increase. arising by way of the expression of liberty and freedom shall cause him to say in one nation where is our leader are they hiding thank you Lord thank you Lord I want you to just begin to lift up your hands like this and imagine for just a moment like Moses who had his hands lifted up and there was a rod in his hand and as his hands were lifted the Amalekites were defeated and Lord we do a prophetic act right now as our hands are lifted high right now as our hands are lifted high we say that every opposing force of darkness against your plan, against your people, against righteousness is absolutely being annihilated by the host of heaven. Now I want you to do something in your chair. I want you to go clockwise, so, that, so don't go my direction. <laughs> you know clockwise. For me, it's this way, right? Help me out here. And just kind of go like this because we demand right now that a new portal of heaven's divine plan, release of hosts, release of righteousness and justice, a new portal opening over this month that shall break these yokes and undo, undo the heavy burdens that have been upon the nations. Right now, we speak and declare it shall be open and it shall not be hindered. It shall not be aborted. It will not be stopped by the forces of darkness. No! Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Acceleration. Now, what I want you to do is go the opposite way. And we close any attempts of that which is connected to divination and witchcraft. We command the fire of God upon them, upon their schemes, upon their altars, where they have spoken their curses. Fire, the fire of God burns those altars to ashes. And the portals are closed that the enemy would desire to open or has used in this time or prior generations thank you lord 
as a sign, let it rain, let it rain, let it begin to rain all over the United States. Let it rain throughout February, rain throughout March and April. Let the heavens be open, God, in the name of Yeshua. Thank you, Lord. Now, some of you have been attacked. And I just speak to every evil entity. I command fire upon the witch, the warlock, the Satanist, the worker of divination. Every one of their curses, assignments, I reverse it and I send it back. And I command fire, the fire of the Holy Ghost upon them. Expose them, expose them, expose them, expose them, expose them. Jesus name and the people Lord I pray blessing upon them right now and anything of the enemy that is trying to touch them or their lives or their bodies I commission the host to shred it spirit soul and body shred it host that it cannot and will not prosper as this is our inheritance no weapon formed against us shall prosper and any word that would rise up to be spoken against us in a curse or in judgment we condemn come on say it say no weapon formed against me it shall not prosper it will not prosper any word any curse spoken against me my family my body my life my belongings my vehicles I condemn it. I cast it down. It is destroyed by the anointing of the Holy Spirit of God. Now give God a big shout. Give him a big shout. Give him a big shout. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Praise God. Man, I never thought in a million years. Breaker 1-9. I mean, when it st I started hearing it, I'm like, what, 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 what? And then it came out of my mouth. I'm like, okay. How many of you ever saw? I never saw that. Here are all those, here are all those people, that convoy, Breaker 1-9. They were prophesying about in a million years. Breaker 1-9. I mean, when it st I started hearing it, I'm like, what, 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 what? And then it came out of my mouth. I'm like, okay. How many of you ever saw? I never saw that. Here are all those, here are all those people, that convoy, Breaker 1-9, they were prophesying about this COVID stuff that's about to be broken. Hey, by the way, did you notice they lifted the mask mandate over Omaha today? No. Yeah. Yeah, like you all complied anyway. But they said the numbers were lower. And I want to say, excuse me, uh, health director, actually the numbers were higher a different number of those who didn't comply would not comply to the lie and i wanted to actually you know what where is anthony here we need to get a t-shirt that says no comply to the lie el caprendo <laughs> no comply to the lie el caprendo yeah that's a t-shirt all right Man, that was some interesting stuff what he said about uh, Russia. See, again, you got to get God's perspective because if you listen to the lamestream news, you're going to think, oh, we're on the verge of World War III. God said it's war, what do you call it? War, war rhetoric. You know what war rhetoric is? It's lying. They're lying about something. Amen. And, I, and you know what's so amazing is the lamestream news, they'll, they, they tell us that we're all lied. And I want to say, um, excuse me, but um, has it ever indicated to you how many of your people are quitting? <laughs> Disappearing? Right? And, and how many of what they accuse us of being the liars is now falling upon their heads and the truth is coming out. They don't know what to do. It's just, you know... I tell you, I, you know, the Bible says something. God hates the lying tongue. 
I would not want to be on the side of those that are lying and think that they can get by with it. And I like what God said, the spirit of truth is getting louder. And I'll tell you one way that the spirit of truth is getting louder is when you open your mouth. <laughs> How about that? You know, this is one time when it's okay to be a big mouth. 